stay You're not gonna leave me This place is right where you need to be And why your words gotta mean so much to them This isn't gonna work, Gideon Oh, and why's that? Cause after I break Ghost Eye's arm and steal that key from your neck I'm gonna wear your butt on my foot like a rhinestone slipper <laughs> And what makes you think you can do all that? Because I'm a flipping corduroy! <laughs> Ghost us! My hench angel! <laughs> Get back! Get back! Or I will drop kick him, I swear! You'll never get away with this, you hear me? Guess what? We already did! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is such a gift to have you here tonight. Such a gift. I have a vision. I predict you will soon all say, Aww. Aww. It came true. What? I'm not impressed. You're impressed. Hit it, Dad. Others can't see. It ain't some sideshow trick, it's a native ability. Where others are blind, I am futurely inclined. And you too could see if you was whittle on me. <laughs> Come on, everybody, rise up! I want y'all to keep it going. How did he keep it going? You wish your son would call you more. I'm leaving everything to my cats. <laughs> I sense that you've been here before. I wasn't gave it away. Come on. I'll read your mind if I'm able. Something tells me your name, Mabel. How do you do that? So welcome all ye to the tent of telepathy. And thanks for visiting. such a ladies man you're my cousin's grandma gross i got you a race car cake man i don't know why Sus hates his birthdays this looks great <laughs> uh sorry dude but could you move seats that's a seat of honor uh who's it for oh <laughs> it's for my dad actually i haven't seen him in like eight years but he's coming today that must be him <laughs> All right, Seuss, today's the big day. Be cool. Be cool. Postcard for... Seuss. Sorry, champ. Couldn't make it this year. Real busy again. See you next year for sure. Dad. Hey, don't sweat it, cuz. You'll see him next year. <laughs> yeah, next year. Uh, I'm gonna go lay down. You party without me. Hey, Stan. Hi, Uncle Stan. Hello, Hello Mr. Mr. Pines. Pines. How's it hanging? Hey, Dipper. Wendy. I didn't see you at the party. Where were you? Uh, I uh, I was trick or treating with my sister. Yeah. Mm, the party was lame anyway. Robbie ate a lollipop stick first and had to go home sick. <laughs> Ah oh, man. We went to every single house, and we didn't even get to eat any candy. Candy? How's that for candy? And now back to the fear guy from Terror Town Street. Kids, I've been thinking. At the end of the day, Summerween isn't about candy or costumes or even scaring people. It's a day when the whole family can get together in one place and celebrate what really matters. Pure evil! <laughs> <laughs> I ate a man alive tonight. Oh, this is going to take some really great training music.
brains. What are you gonna do, huh? What are you gonna do? by Lil Big Dog? It's the catchiest song of the summer. What is Blanchin'? Rappers can't just make up words. Rappers are visionaries, Wendy. If they told me to eat my own pants, I would do it. Eat your own pants, eat your own pants, yeah. I guess I have no choice. Do-do-do. Shh, I'm picking something up. Stupid thing. There we go. Uh, Pacifica? It's a trans-universal gateway, a punched hole through a weak spot in our dimension. I created it to unlock the mysteries of the universe, but it could just as easily be harnessed for terrible destruction. That's why I shut it down and hid my journals, which explain how to operate it. There's only one journal left, and you are the only person I can trust to take it. I have something to ask of you. Remember our plans to sail around the world on a boat? Take this book, get on a boat, and sail as far away as you can, to the edge of the earth. Bury it where no one can find it. That's it? 
You finally want to see me after 10 years, and it's to tell me to get as far away from you as possible? Stanley, you don't understand what I'm up against, what I've been through. No, no, you don't understand what I've been through. I've been to prison in three different countries. I once had to chew my way out of the trunk of a car. You think you've got problems? I've got a mullet, Stanford! Meanwhile, where have you been? Living it up in your fancy house in the woods. Selfishly hoarding your college money because you only care about yourself. I'm selfish? I'm selfish, Stanley? How can you say that after costing me my dream school? I'm giving you a chance to do the first worthwhile thing in your life and you won't even listen. Well, listen to this. You want me to get rid of this book? Fine, I'll get rid of it right now. No, you don't understand. You said you wanted me to have it, so I'll do what I want with it. My research! <laughs> Stanley, give it back! <laughs> you want it back, you're gonna have to try harder than that! me behind you jerk it was supposed to be us forever you ruined my life you ruined your own life ah! stanley oh my gosh i'm so sorry are you all Ow! some brother you turned out to be you care more about your dumb mysteries than your family well then you can have them whoa whoa hey what's going on hey hey stanford Stanley! Stanley, help me! Oh no, what do I do? Stanley! Stanley! Do something! Stanley! Stanford? Stanford, come back! I didn't mean it! I just got him back! I can't lose him again! Ah, come on! Stanford! I need your advice. We're hanging out in a haunted convenience store. I can't get a hold of Grunkle Stan. And if I try to say anything about it to any of these guys, they'll just think I'm a scared little kid or something. <laughs> Mabel? The future is in the past. Onward, Sayoshima! <laughs> Mabel, how many of these did you eat? Eleventeen. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. This'll work! This has to work! Here's the first day we came to Gravity Falls, Grunkle Stan. And here's a macaroni interpretation of my emotions! That time we went fishing? That summer wing we spent together? Don't you remember anything? I'm sorry. I don't know what this is or who you are. Or... Gah! Quit it, Waddles! I'm trying to remember my life story! <gasps> What did you say? I said get waddled off of me. <gasps> it's working. Keep reading. Skip the my page. He needs to remember our boss-employee relationship. Hey, just because I have amnesia, don't go trying to give yourself a raise, Zeus. It's happening. Keep going. Okay, okay. Day two. Grunkle Stan smells weird, but we're starting to bond. He told us a lot about being a businessman in the 80s and seemed happy when we pretended to listen. He also gave me a grappling hook, which everyone is impressed by. And in more important news, I met some neighbors. doesn't work if you don't all hold hands and what's better you've brought every threat to my power together in one easy to destroy circle oh, oh no ah, my hair ah, my hair also you guys want to see what happens to your friends when you can't get along hey you give them back you've gone too far cypher yeah we're not scared of you oh but you should be Looks like it's too late for your friends, Stanford! All right, Grunkle Stan, where did you hide that card? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Ew, pretending I never saw that. Not so fast! You two wait here! I've got some children I need to make into corpses! Passwords, passwords.
Mabel is useless. Oh, oh man. Too many failed entries. Huh? Initiate data erase in five minutes. No, 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 no. I'm gonna lose everything? I only have one more try? Well, 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 well. Someone's looking desperate. Thought I told you to leave me alone. I can help you, kid. You just need to hear out my demands. What crazy thing do you want, anyway? To eat my soul? To rip out my teeth? Are you gonna replace my eyes with baby heads or something? Yeesh, kid, relax! All I want is a puppet! A puppet? What are you playing at? Everyone loves puppets! And it looks to me like you've got a surplus! <sighs> I, I don't know, man. Mabel worked really hard on these. Seems to me one little puppet is a small price to pay to learn all the secrets of the universe! universe. universe. Besides, what's your sister done for you lately? How many times have you sacrificed for her, huh? And when has she ever returned the favor? Tick-tock, kid! Uh, just one puppet? Fine! So what puppet are you gonna pick, anyway? Hmm, let's see. Eeny, meeny, miny... No! What? This can't be happening! What did you do to my body? Sorry, kid, but you're my puppet now! <laughs> oh, I can't believe this! The kids are gonna die and it's all my fault! Because I couldn't shake your stupid hand! Ah, Dad was right about me. I am a screw-up. Ah, don't blame yourself. I'm the one who made a deal with Bill in the first place. I fell for all his easy flattery. You would have seen him for the scam artist he is. How did things get so messed up between us? We used to be like Dipper and Mabel. The world's about to end and they still work together. How do they do it? Easy. They're kids. They don't know any better. Whoa, where are you going? I'm going to play the only card we have left. Let Bill into my mind. He'll be able to take over the galaxy, and maybe even worse. But at least he might let the kids free. What? Are you kidding me? Are you honestly telling me there's nothing else we can do? Bill's only weak in the mind space. If I didn't have this darn plate in my head, we could just erase him with the memory gun when he steps inside my mind. What if he goes into my mind? My brain isn't good for anything. <laughs> there's nothing in your mind he wants. It has to be me. We need to take his deal. It's the only way he'll agree to save you and the kids. Do you really think he's going to make good on that deal? What other choice do we have? 